Hey there everybody, Richard R. Blast here and welcome to day 3 of the 365 day video challenge. Hope you're having an awesome day, pardon the noise, I'm just massaging my feet. As you can probably see there, oh, that's really, really, really nice. Yeah, got some other videos in store for you today. Check this, check, oh, uh, that beer. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense at all, but we'll do it in one take. To so say, uh, stay, watch this space for some more videos. Catch you later. Right, uh, slight change of plan. I was going to discuss something else, but we're going to do a quick segment while we're going to try this. So if you're a vegetarian, try not to watch this video because we'll be cooking pork sausages. This could go completely and utterly wrong. Right then, I hope you can hear me above the noise of the extractor fan. I've skipped past the stuff that I can't do one-handed. Well, most of the stuff. So now what we're going to do, we're going to stick some... This is the only healthiest part of this will be this floor cuisine cooking liquid so what we're going to do is we're going to squirt some of that into there like that probably put a bit too much in so let's transfer this to let's transfer that to the pan and as soon as that starts to bubble we'll swoosh it round the pan so what we'll do we'll stick this back in the fridge now I'm not going to tidy up for you guys for the moment. <laughs> that's one of the comments I got on the on the previous video was to tidy your kitchen up. I will do eventually. So just put this stuff back in the fridge. If I've done this correctly, yep. I always put it on number four for this. So I think we're getting ready now, yeah there we are, swoosh it round the pan. I think he's getting used to using this camera and then looking through the viewfinder instead of looking directly at the thing, there we go. Something just appeared on the camera, you know what, oh, probably done some weird autofocus thing, so what we'll do, wait for that to bubble up. Right, then I'll just shout up a bit, as you can see that's bubbling away nicely, that's almost ready for me now. Some of you might say, oh that's not cooked enough, but then again I'm not a professional cook, I can't cook anything properly. So here we go, so here are the sausages, I've already cut them all, I've already cut the links, because I can't do it one handed, so here we go. Sausage number one in the pan, sausage number two in the pan. Sausage number three in the pan and sausage number four in the pan and then we'll just try and put the lid on left handed there we go just leave them for a couple of minutes and then we'll turn them there you go as you can probably see there I've already turned the sausages Eee, that was interesting, just had a visit visit from the local fire service doing a an assessment because apparently they had a an incident nearby so they're just checking that everyone's okay and everyone's got smoke alarms fitted. Anyway, back to our usual scheduled programme. We're now getting closer to these being cooked out. Don't know how you can see that. Hopefully you can hear me because I've just put the other extractor fan and as you can see obviously I do like them well cooked and there you go there's the finished result thanks for watching
and yeah oh I'm back again and that brings day three to an end thanks for watching catch you tomorrow